Biwerkas Ibores Hara Geopark Landscapes Born Under the Sea The Viuercas Ibores Jara region is located to the southwest of the province of Cáceres, near the borders of Badajoz and Toledo. To the north, the Tajo River. To the west, the region is demarcated by the Monfragüe National Park and the plains of Trujillo. This area, prized for its highly scenic value, is known for its unique relief, where succeeding parallel mountain ranges are capped by Pico Viuercas, a mountain that dominates the surrounding area with a height of 1,600 meters. The extraordinary orography of the region has given rise to interaction between mankind and the environment, reflected in the region's history in the formation and distribution of its 25 core towns, in its culture and in the way of life of its nearly 15,000 inhabitants. It is geology and geomorphology that categorically define the personality of this area, where one can see the oldest rocks in the Iberian Peninsula and numerous interesting formations such as characteristic Appalachian reliefs. Mountain ranges and valleys through which rivers and streams flow, offspring of the Tajo and the Guadiana. Sunny and shady spots house a rich and often unique botanical biodiversity clearly exemplified by Portugal laurel trees. Putting all these elements together led the region under the plan for the stimulation of tourism managed by the provincial delegation of Cáceres to set up the foundations of what will be Extremadura's first geopark. On the 23rd of July 2009, the Ministry of Commerce and Tourism the Department of Culture and Tourism of the Regional Government of Andalusia, the University of Extremadura and the Provincial Delegation of Cáceres, along with the region's organizations, the Integral Commonwealth of Municipalities, the Association for the Rural Promotion and Development of the Villuercas Ibores Jara Region, APRODERVI, Local Action Group, and VIBOTUR, the Entrepreneurial Association for Tourism, sign the protocols for the Geopark's creation. A great many places of geological interest, along with a strategy for sustainable development, led to this declaration. The Castañar de Ibor cave stands out thanks to its uniqueness and fragility. A narrow entrance opens up underground to a fascinating and magical world. Throughout its nearly 2,000 meters length are exhibited some of the best examples known of Aragonite speleothems in extremely thin and delicate shapes and in light colors that contrast with the dark reddish tones of the slate and clay that surround them. The spectacular gorge known as the Estrecho de la Peña in Alia is a genuine window into the distant past. Throughout the region there are many examples that demonstrate that the mountain ranges of today were the seabeds of approximately 500 million years ago. Another characteristic formation of these slopes is the boulder field, which so represents the region. Folds, ravines, faults, mines, geological gems that should be valued. Here, some of the oldest fossils on the Iberian Peninsula have been found similar to others found in Asia or Central Africa. The unique Rañas de Cañamero serve as support for the vineyards that produce wines under the protected denomination of origin Ribera del Guadiana. Meadows of cork and oak trees provide a home to the Iberian pig, which integrates itself into the protected denomination of origin Deesa de Extremadura. Over banks and hillsides graze herds of goats, the source of another protected denomination of origin, that of Ibores cheese.
Myriad Mediterranean flora serve as the means of support for the production of Euerca Ciboris honey, yet another protected denomination of origin product. Soil with unparalleled mycological richness, oils, cherries, chestnuts, sweets, foodstuffs that support and strengthen the touristic offering of the geopark, complemented by a variety of accommodation and restaurants. Paths and trails that wind through forests filled with chestnut and oak trees, a paradise for deer and boar, that make this land one of the most highly prized places in Europe for hunters. The natural value on which the geopark is being developed has been recognized internationally through the declaration of various protected areas within the network. Natura 2000, unique trees, areas of community interest, the biosphere reserve, the area for the special protection of birds from the Sierra de Villuercas and the Valle de Guadaranque have become a starting point for tourism catering to bird watchers and nature lovers. The skies fill with large Iberian raptors and the quartz peaks house many vultures and in the winter illustrious guests visit from the north, the cranes who take over the fields of Logrosan. The region also holds valuable patrimony in schematic cave paintings with richness in color unique to Extremadura. With all of these resources available, the proposal has been tabled with the support of Tour España, the Club for Tourism, for the creation of the Geopark, which will serve to coordinate promotional activities along with the other five Spanish geoparks. It will furthermore establish relations with the European Geopark Network, the international network of geoparks maintained by UNESCO. The definitive creation of the geopark, along with Guadalupe tourism generated through the monastery, a World Heritage Site, constitute the basis for the tourism strategy of the region. These are unique resources we are obliged to preserve so that our children's children will be able to continue enjoying them and so that they will be able to live there with a sense of pride in Villuercas y Bores Jara. <laughs>